It's 2015 Tops Heritage Baseball. No Padres are in here, but teams are comboed for us. You got terrific opportunities. Here's a list of everybody on the break. Jeremiah B., you're starting off on the bottom of the list. Brian J., you're on the top. I've copied it, pasted it into random.org, and sending it through seven times one. Oh, here we go. Number two. Three, four, five, six. Lucky number seven. Lucky number seven. Dave Ari on the bottom of the list. Annette C's on the top. I've copied that list. And grabbing our spreadsheet to paste into in Tops Heritage Baseball. Feel free to make a trade. And as I go through this list, you can see Annette C. You pulled the dime back. Sean D. The Braves. Stephen M. The Orioles. Dave R. The Red Sox. Terry H. The Cubs. Dave R. The White Sox. Kenneth J. The Reds. Eric S. You own the Indians. Nigel C. The Rockies. Sean D. The Tigers. Kenneth J. The Astros. Dwayne M. The Royals, Jeremiah B. The Angels, Kenneth J. The Dodgers, Stephen M. The Marlins, Jason P. The Brewers, Philip G. The Mets, Jeffrey B. The Yankees, Ricardo R. The Pirates, Sean D. The Giants, Rosendo, you own the Mariners, Eric S. The Cardinals, Stephen M. The Rangers, Rosendo R. You have the Blue Jays, Corey G. You have the Nationals, Brian J. Combo Spot, A's and Phillies, Dave R. You pull a combo spot, two Twins and Rays. Yeah, I got a checklist around here. Thanks, Nigel. As long as everybody knows your team, you can make a trade or do whatever, and I'm going to pop this thing open. So if you if you do still need to know your team, you didn't see or you missed something, shout it out. I'll be glad to answer anybody's question about what team someone has. All right, the division break's about to happen. And this stuff has got a lot of style to it. This is, uh, that's cool. This is different. In the last box we did, there was a uh, panel card. And it was three. But this obviously isn't going to be a panel that's too small to be a panel. Maybe it's that Mary Mariana Rivera auto from the the picture. Could be. Oh man, that's exciting. Good luck everybody. I don't see oh yeah, loads of short prints in here. I'm going to be flying through the base. Keep an eye out for something. Uh let's get a big pull. Here we go. No trades. Could be Ernie Banks. Let's do it. Mm -mm -mm. Here we go. Castellanos. If you see a card with two players on it, you know I'm surprised, Jersey. I was just thinking the same thing. If you see a card with two, it'll go to the player on the left or the player on the top. Usually it's really easy to tell. Look at the flashbacks card. We're going to random this off. I'm surprised our last box must have been a hot box. Wow, and, and we just didn't know because it was our first box, but there was purples in, in like every pack. And now in this box, we haven't even seen a purple. They weren't numbered, but they were nice-looking parallels. That's going to go to the Dodgers. Mmm. And a, a few of us were hollering hot box and stuff like that. But because it was our first box, I couldn't really be 100% sure but obviously, our first box was a hot box. There is one auto or relic in here, and we're sifting through. Now, we're shipping all of this, too. Look at that. If it's an action card, it's you know it's a parallel. That's a beautiful 
One right there coming out to the Twins owner, the Harmon Killebrew. St. Louis pulls a flashback. Nice shot. St. Louis owner. That's Eric S. who owns the Cardinals with that flashback. Oh, there's a nice one right there. Felix Hernandez, New Age Performers. Coming out for the Seattle owner. That's Rosendo. And I like the comic strip on the back of these. They definitely have an old style. I don't know if that's a gum stain. Mmm. One one hit per box. It's either an auto or a relic. And this one's coming to random. We got Spectra Football. We got National Treasures Hockey. We got a lot of cool things to choose from here at FBB. Right now, we're digging in on this 66-style heritage. You can see the Koufax owner just got one with the Kershaw. The L.A. Dodgers owner had a nice one right there. Kenneth J. And I really enjoy the comic strip at the top on each card. It definitely has that vintage look to it. It actually has a vintage feel to them as well. What in the world? <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> mm. Spring training is upon us. Really curious how A Rod's going to do uh, trying to come back from all that. Now, I'm a Red Sox fan, but it just kind of got me curious. Is he going to come back with any kind of pop or anything, or is he totally done? After the, the PDs. Is he totally done? Or is he going to try to resurge? He's going to come in as a DH. If, he, if his bat's swinging at all. Very excited for the... the oh, there's a, there's a nice one right here. Look at this, everybody. This is what we're looking for. Tiger's owner. Ho! Sean D! Nice Victor Martinez. That is 689 of 999. What a nice pull right there on the Victor Martinez. Tigers owner scores. All right. All right. Depend on. It was good to see you and look forward to the next time. Oh, give me a break. <laughs> well, there they are. Oh, second place. That's where they belong. Second place. Yeah. One of my favorite Yankees cards. Shows them in second. <laughs> Nice one for the Gonzalez owner. There's a nice insert for San Francisco owner. That was Sean D. who owns the Giants.
Flashbacks for the Cardinals. First, uh, uh, uh. So we haven't hit our auto or our relic yet. I haven't even seen that yet. Oh, what do you know? It's a Justin Verlander. Oh my gosh. Look at that. This is really nice. Tigers owner, you've done it again. You scored the Victor Martinez. Now you got this one. Sean D. Nice going on the game used memorabilia. It is a Clubhouse Collections. Sean D. Congratulations. Tony Gwynn Jr. Hmm. And we have a case break of this coming up, too. You'll be able to get in on and score big. Several hits will come out for you. And the case break. One big hit in every one of these. I'm very curious about this. And this one right here. It looks like there's going to be an original 1966 card in this break. So be ready. Here's a new age. Cubs owner. Nice insert. Here it is. It says one original 1966 card. Ah, uh, well, what's it going to be? Who's going to score big? What is this thing? Who is it? What is it? Oh, my. This is an original. Ho! Philadelphia Phillies owner. My, oh, my. Look at this original. Oh, a nice pull. Congratulations. That's coming out to Brian J. And that thing is old. It's got, you know, it's not in pristine condition, really. But there's some, some nostalgia right there. That's That's cool. All right, so here's two of these, and we're going to send it through the randomizer and see who gets a couple flashback cards. And so here it is. And we're just going to use the original random and send it through seven more times. The winner is going to come up on the top of the list. And here's the original random. Here's random number one. Two, I can zoom in a little bit for number three. And it'll say 14 because it's seven more after the first seven originally. Four, five, six. A lucky number seven. Kenneth J, you're on the top of this list. That means you're coming away with a couple flashbacks. I'll zoom in up there at the top. Kenneth J comes up with some flashbacks. Nice going. And that is our box of heritage, everybody.
All right, crazy. That was a nice Victor Martinez parallel. Or variation. Lots of big hits coming out of every box. We're getting ready for our division break in museum football. As I go ahead and still, I'm going to send this video out to YouTube. Pop up a link if you're in on a box. That's right, Vegas. So Vegas says, hey, man, hop on board. Get in with us and get a big pull in museum. Good luck, everybody, in your next box break. Could be another heritage break about to happen, too. Could be some Spectra. Can't wait to see more Spectra.